Uh, somebody called and asked, and this was before you got on, they said, would you please ask Dr. Paul if he's been able to find out if his votes have been tampered with? Uh, he's referring to Maine and Iowa. Um, I think I think they have, but I don't have the proof to take him to court. I think uh, uh, Nevada, there's pretty good evidence. Uh, I, I do think, but I don't think it's a grand conspiracy, but I think that uh, the we find a lot of resentment from local Republican leaders, and they, they you know, they might have a hundred show up at their caucus meetings traditionally, and two hundred Ron Paul supporters will show up, and they really are annoyed. They don't want these young people coming into the party. It's our party, you know. It's a it's a it's a club, and they don't like it. So they do not want to see the credibility of these votes. That so they do everything possible. And I've heard so many stories about how the votes get manipulated. But as far as evidence goes and as far as trying to prove anything, uh, I have enough things to worry about. I'm trying to stop another war in Iran right now rather than <laughs> than uh, pursuing that. I wish some people would. The ones who know about it, they ought to pursue this and, and, and see if they can, whatever they can document. All right. The, um, the, the caucuses here in Missouri are tomorrow. Uh, here's what the rumor mill is. I got like two questions, this one and one more, and then I know I've got to let you go. Uh, but one of the uh, rumor mill is that, that, uh, you've got a lot more, uh, uh, supporters involved in this than, than the Republicans or the mainstream media realize, uh, and that you've got a lot more delegates than they realize. True or not? Oh, you mean generally speaking? Yeah. Or just, oh yeah, I definitely think so because, uh, you know, we may well end up winning Iowa. You know, that's a possibility, in spite of the fact that the other two were deciding that they, which they were arguing over who really won it. But no, the delegate process is uh, going forth in, in many of the states. I think that, you know, they, you know, maybe the numbers can be twisted a little bit for these, uh, for PR purposes and for these straw votes. But I think the delegate process, uh, our persistence and determination of our supporters, uh, they, they know the rules. Uh, sometimes the party resents the fact, well, you guys keep using the rules against us. So they know the rules and they know how to work on it. And I think in a month or two, we'll have a better feel for how far so many have gone because they are very determined. And uh, there may be some really interesting surprises that come out here in the next couple of months. One of the things that uh, I remember learning when I was campaigning was to give out my website <clears throat> as often as I could. And uh, for those people who are interested in supporting your uh, your campaign for liberty here, your your uh, the, the run for the White House, what is the website? It's ronpaul2012.com. ronpaul2012.com. Uh, I don't care if you win or lose. Of course, I want you to win, and that's why I already sent some money. Uh, because the longer you're out on the road, the more voices, uh, the more your voice is heard, and the better chance we have of, uh, I think, saving the republic. So, best of luck no, to you, Carpe Diem. Wonderful, and, and thank you for all you do. All right, Dr. Paul, thank you.